it's a new dawn it's a new day it's a new life and i'm feeling good hope you are too Hey everybody, hope your week has been awesome. So last week we talked about a couple of hashtags that you'll hear throughout my videos and we talked about think different. So this week we'll be talking about hashtag numero dos, which is hashtag new norms. So before I begin telling you all about what this means to me, I want to start with just a few scriptures. So the first one is John 1 and 5 and it says, the light shines in the darkness and the darkness can never extinguish it. Now the second one is in Ephesians 5 and let me tell you, if you haven't read Ephesians 5, you need to stop what you're doing right now, pause this video and read it because it is legit for real. But for the sake of time, I'll be going to verse 8 and it says, for once you were full of darkness, but now you have light from the Lord. So live as people of light, for this light within you produces only what is good and right and true. Carefully determine what pleases the Lord. Take no part in the worthless deeds of evil and darkness. Instead, expose them. And lastly, we're going to read 1 Timothy chapter 4. Now, again, I encourage you to read this whole chapter because it's lit. But for now, for the sake of time, we're going to look at verse 12. Now, let me tell you, this is my life verse because I think it's so important for us as young Christians to live by and it says don't let anyone think less of you because you are young be an example to all believers in what you say in the way you live in your love your faith and your purity now if we look at all three of these verses together you'll see the themes kind of running together it talks about being the light and darkness and how the darkness won't overcome the light and imitating god and not imitating the world and then it also talks about being an example to all people in your actions and the way you live and your love and in your faith and in your purity and with that being said i noticed that a lot of times when i tell my story or i see a trend going on within the community um, whether it be things like waiting on God for your spouse or just waiting in general, a waiting journey, waiting to have sex until you're married, um, different things like that. And people's reactions to them have really shocked me. People even in the Christian community have been so surprised that people are trying to honor the Lord. And that's kind of crazy, don't you think? We should expect and hold one another accountable to kind of have that as a normal thing. Like it shouldn't be surprising to us that we want to honor the Lord. And then that's what got me to thinking. Why is it that things that we're doing that are right, that God tells us to do, following his word and trying to honor God, why is that something that is so shocking? even in the Christian community. Aren't we all supposed to be on the same path, trying to live right, trying to honor the Lord, trying to be an example for everyone in the way that we live, in the way that we love, in our faith and in our purity? Hence why I say we should be creating new norms because as believers we should be impacting the world so greatly that it shouldn't just be normal to do things as the way of the world it should be normal to do things the way that the lord wants us to do it so when we hear about people wanting to honor the lord in their relationships or wanting to wait until marriage to have sex or even just seeking god for everyday decisions to make because we should be relying on god for everything that stuff should be normal to us. We should be creating a new culture, new norms in our culture for people to follow because we should be leading by example. So I ask you, what are you going to do to create new norms? I would love to hear about some things that you do currently or are going to start putting into practice to be an example to people around you and to create new norms in the culture around you, in your community, in your circle. And so make sure you comment below, like this video, subscribe to my channel, make sure you turn on your notifications so you can know when the next video is out. And don't forget to share, share, share this video. It's so important that we infiltrate the media with light and not darkness. And as always, remember, we're just like you. We just think different. Let the whole world know. Yeah. Let the whole